300,000 American children suffer from the debilitating disease epilepsy and its seizures. But it turns out that there is the least likely source of hope. And our Dr. Richard Besser is back with bacon, sausage, butter, cream? Pretty incredible. Diane, these are the foods that I tell my patients to take it easy on. But for the children you're about to meet, this is what they eat over the course of a week, and this makes all of the difference. Okay, you're okay. Starting at age three, Evan would have up to 50 seizures a day. Having him seizing, and there was basically nothing I could do. His parents say the medicine didn't work, turned him into a zombie. It would take Evan five minutes to walk across the street so he could stand there, have a seizure, and fall down. Then Evan's parents found bacon. This cure on a plate is known as the keto diet. 90% fats like heavy cream. Virtually no sugars or starches. Evan's parents aren't alone. 70 miles away lives Jack, another little boy with epilepsy. Jack was laying down. His eyes had rolled in the back of his head. He was twitching um, all over. Today, Jack's mother feeds him more mayo and more cream in one week than my entire family eats in a month. But far from being indulgent, this diet requires more discipline than an Olympian. Even one Cheerio has too much sugar for him. Jack loves cheese. Right. Why would any parent do this to a sick child? They hope it will trick his brain into a system reset. Here's how it works. Normally, our brains are fueled by glucose sugar. But when we eat only fats, we don't get enough glucose. So the body makes a new brain fuel from the fat, something called ketones. Seizures are like an electrical storm in the brain. Mysteriously, a big dose of these ketones minimize or even eliminate seizures. One thing I worry about is, is giving false hope to people. How effective is this treatment? About a third of children who go on this diet become completely seizure-free. And it's working. Jack's seizures are down 90%, but it's strict. Epilepsy took him away from us. The diet is, is it's a way to get him back. Remember little Evan? You ready to come out? This is him now. After four days on this diet, Evan's seizures stopped. After six months, he was off all his medication. He's even off the diet. He was cured, absolutely. Years on keto rewired his brain. You couldn't read before? No. Not even get into the book, I would just have a seizure and fall. It's a miracle that Evan wants to share. Taking little Jack under his wing. You're going to meet all of the Boston Bruins. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> Jack, I heard that you don't like heavy cream. Two kids, partners in hope. What do you think? Well, it's very important that parents don't try this diet on their own. Children can become severely malnourished. You need a trained neurologist. But, Diane, for those children for whom it works, it, it, it's absolutely miraculous. And you were telling me, Rich, it could be something for other diseases as well, affecting the brain? Well, it's absolutely fascinating. Studying how nutrition can affect diseases as, as different as Alzheimer's, Parkinson's disease, and even some types of cancer. Wow, this is an amazing it's story. Incredible. We were amazed, but you got to work on your arm wrestle here. You got to represent the team. <laughs> they had me whooped. <laughs> they did. Thanks.